How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Gamer Oasis in our final episode of Fuck our... the Portuguese. Pokemon. Or Pokemon. Nope. Uh, Bioshock Infinite. Let's play. Uh, Do it. Yeah. Are you gonna... So this is not going to go according to plan. Oh. We're about to find out. This is totally not going to work. There he goes. Was he in that thing when it blew? You psychopath! All right, she's not my least favorite character. Yeah, I mean, it was gonna kill us because the thing broke. Oh, yeah. And now we're underwater. Yeah, we are uh, we're in Rapture right now. Is this from the other Bioshock? Yes. Ah. This is the location of the first two Bioshocks. Over here, Booker. This is where we have to go. Why? What is going on? Elizabeth, what do you mean if this is a doorway? <laughs> yeah, she's going to show us. And this is the thing that you use to... To get kinky. Go down... Uh, because you show up at a lighthouse and then you go down underwater and you get rapture. Is that the same lighthouse we went to to fucking get shot to the fucking moon? I don't know. That was a great question. Probably. I mean, what other lighthouses have those unique capabilities? <laughs> this whole world is fucked up. Yeah. It's cool, though. This is so impractical. Yeah, but I mean, you know, they wanted to be away from... Where does oxygen set. come from? Uh, pipes. <laughs> well, suck if you're allergic to shellfish. You can only eat, like, two things. We offended Southerners yet? Yes. No. Cousin here, fuckers. I, I could fully control it. I, I thought. What is that? It's a key. Where did it come from? It's always been there. I just. I just couldn't see it. What the fuck are you people talking about? Joel, I'll explain it once, once we get there. Oh, hi. Different, awesome, constants, and variables. 
What in the shit? Yeah, Joel. Do you have a comment? Nah, I'm good. Okay. <laughs> I think we just took some bad acid. Okay. It's a child diddler. He was in fact here. Mm hmm. Okay. I mean, I, I watched him drown him. You okay, Joel? We're getting there. Okay. Then just stay in this world. What are you feeling for food? I don't know. What do you want? I don't know. Okay. 
Might be a decision for after. I think so. I'm in the mood <laughs> for a burger. Oh. I could well. go for a nice burger. I'll do that. You get it now? Oh. Yeah. Anna. Her name's Anna. Anna DeWitt. <laughs> AD. Wow, that just got really dark. Yeah. Gonna smother a baby in his crib? It's to stop Comstock from ever <clears throat> existing. It's the goal here now. And so we gave birth to a daughter with superpowers? Yeah, I think so. I, th I wasn't sure if it was just the birth or being affected by like the time warp thingy. Gave her the powers, you know what I mean? Hi. This is one of those moments I wish we were doing face cam because the look on your face what is the? so ridiculous. So we're we're both Comstock and DeWitt, right? So, and we just so so so, you know how we went to the Hall of Heroes and Booker was like, I was at Wounded Knee and I was at uh, the Boxer Rebellion. Yeah. The things he saw there, he was like, 
he felt sick with himself. He felt he's a murderer, so he went to a baptism to to get rid of his sins, right? And in some universes, he takes the uh, the the baptism and becomes Comstock. In other worlds, he doesn't and becomes Booker stays Booker Dewitt. The whole thing is in the alternate universes. There's constants and variables. The constant is he always goes to the baptism. The variable is he either takes it or he doesn't. So to get rid of Comstock, basically what he did was all the Elizabeths in every timeline and all the Bookers of every timeline decided to kill himself so he never existed. So Comstock never existed. And that's why... Uh, so yes. he fight clubbed himself. Yes, he fight clubbed himself. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> well, so, the whole thing is, um... You know how, uh, I guess it's the best The best point <clears throat> is the, uh, times that we... You know how we meet the Lutesses every so often? In the very beginning of the game, they asked... They were doing the coin flip, right? Yeah. And if you notice, it's always heads. That's an example of one of the universe's constants. Every time Booker meets those people, they flip the coin, it's gonna be heads. So A variable is... When we chose the thing for her choker yes that's a variable so did that choker have any effect on anything here no other other than to demonstrate the fact that it's a constant variable and it even goes to bioshock uh, the original there's always a man there's always a lighthouse there's always a city in this case it was columbia booker and the lighthouse in bioshock it's rapture uh, the main character, whose name I forget, and then the separate different lighthouse. That's very interesting. Yeah, it's something, huh? Yeah, that's something else. So, knowing all that, Joel, what's your opinion of the game? I mean, I might have to go through it again and pay <laughs> attention. Holy fuck. What the fuck just happened? Yeah. <coughs> um... Yeah, so that's why that's why he had AD on the back of his hand, because it stands for Anna DeWitt, his daughter, who he sold to get rid of debt. But he didn't have that on his hand when he got stabbed. Yeah, he did. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. I don't think he did. He had it the whole game. I'm not sure if he did. I mean, you can go back and look if you'd like. I might. But it's been there the entire game. Right. And the poster that we saw towards the beginning that talked about the Antichrist has the AD, because that's the mark of the Antichrist. Or the, uh, not the Antichrist, the, the false prophet. So, when he drowned Comstock, he drowned himself? Yes. But a different version of himself. So, it's a lot like, you know how, um, you know how in the DC Universe there's like Earth 2 and... Florida. And Florida. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> like the how the how the main series of DC takes place on Earth thirty four, yeah, yeah, it's like that essentially, right. And the whole reason the game is even happening is because the Lutesses ended up being stuck in that kind of time warp like Elizabeth is, so they can see all the doors. What the hell's an Elizabeth mocap? What? Motion capture. Yeah. The, yeah. The, yeah. They did the motion capture for yeah, Elizabeth. So. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I uh, I actually before this I I looked up a video explaining the ending just so I got everything right, just to make sure I could explain it properly. Um, but yeah, um, I, you know, it's one of those things where I can't prove it. But when I was playing through the game, when I got towards the end, I was like. I kind of put two and two together and kind of figured out that DeWitt is also Comstock from a definite... There's no way I can prove that, and so... But I did. I kind of just... A thought that came to my mind, but... So... Yes. So... Yes. He... Sold his daughter to himself... To wipe away debt? Yes, but he didn't know that Comstock was himself, obviously. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Girls just want to have fun. Yeah, that's in the game. Sure. Yeah, there's little points where you can, uh... 
where you can find like uh, because of the time warp thing. Dude, tainted love, no shit. Yeah, uh, you, the time warp thing. You can find uh, like old school versions of those songs because they heard them and then like, oh, we're gonna make this a song, but they made it for the time. Sure. Yeah, it's a whole thing. That was uh, that was something. Yeah. I, <laughs> again, I said it when we were doing the thing, but what? When there's the multiple Elizabeths and I looked over to you, your face was fucking priceless. <laughs> so great. That was it, it is it that is very creepy imagery though, with all those Elizabeths there. Confusing imagery. Well, like I said, you know, it's all the Elizabeths throughout the timelines agreeing with Booker to kill Booker, so there is no Comstock. Yes. Yeah, trust me, man. It's all good. Okay. Yeah. That was definitely something. Yeah. Were you were you expecting to get that mind fucked by the end of this game? Apparently, I'm in the wrong here because I just looked up reviews. This thing's got ten out of ten and nine point five out of ten from critics. So. Did you not like it? No, I thought it was interesting. I it just lost me, like well, almost instantly. Well, this. To be fair, uh, the, the the format of doing a Let's Play is kind of hard to pay attention to uh, what's happening, because, you know, you're trying to also be entertaining. So I kind of get that. Oh, I mean, also, you weren't actually playing the game either. True. So that could kill a little bit of the investment in it. But Thanks to my wife, Erin, who married me despite crunch. Uh, that's either an inside joke or they're talking about crunch like they were trying to finish the game. So they worked like doubles. That's what I think they're talking about. But My shoes hurt. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out awesome. to you. <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> oh, man. Redacted will never be a problem again. I don't care if it's cliche. Thanks, Bob. These are awesome. Yeah. Thanks, Dad, for my imagination. Would like a shot of shoddy. <laughs> yeah. that, that, one of those like you said thanks to sushi and my cats. I don't know if they're going to show it in this version, but um, there is a, there is a, <coughs> or in the first version there was a, there was like during the credits they showed um, a like live action version of the voice actor for Booker and the voice actress for Elizabeth doing that song that we, uh, that they played when Booker picked up the guitar. Right. I don't know if they're going to show it in this. Um, if they do, I'll cut it ahead. Um, because this video is already running a little bit long. Um, but, like I said, like I say in every video, uh, for those of you who have stuck around this far... Fuck off. <laughs> thank you very much for your support. Um, this is another one, uh, another uh, game in the books for us. Um, it's a little... Honestly, it's a little up in the air what we're going to do next. Yes. Because uh, I'm not exactly sh sure on that yet. I just want to uh, say now, this yeah. isn't getting cut, is it? No. Oh, okay. Um, I have nothing against anybody who was offended during this Let's Play. It was just the theme. I genuinely like everybody. You didn't mean any of the shit he was saying? No. Good. Except for the gays who are all up in your face about it. Like, simmer down, I don't care. Oh, also, you said, the, you said some strong stuff about uh, vegans and... Uh... Oh, well, yeah, they just need yeah. to shut the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> Good for you, but just shut up. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, I am not a spiteful person. Okay. Is Depending there... on the situation. Is there anything else you want to say? No. Okay. <laughs> um, so, like I said, if that thing comes up, I'll... Uh... Please send your hate mail to brownjoelf350 on Instagram. And also follow me if you're there. Yeah, and follow me if you're there, if you felt offended. 
Yeah. Yes. Ah. Oh, this is it. I'd fuck her. <laughs> is it bad that that's the first thought that comes into my head? Maybe. Taurus isn't fantastic. Well, I mean, he, he's a voice actor. So he's just kind of, he knows a little bit, so he's just kind of doing it to set the mood. Like, get into the moment. I guess. But there wasn't one person on this entire project that actually played the guitar? Well, I'm sure there, there is. Because it sounds good in the game. I guess. They probably soundboarded the shit out of it. <laughs> yeah, that's better. Not very close. For people who don't know, uh, I don't know the name of the actress for uh, Elizabeth, but the voice actor for uh, Booker is, uh, holy shit, I just had his name. Holy shit. Troy Baker. Yes. Yeah. Who's in like a ton of different shit. Basically in everything. 